the 21 of my 90 day video challenge. Almost forgot friends. It's been quite the day here and I thought I'd open with a shot of our four advent candles now lit. The colors are kind of off but I haven't been able to find my advent candles since we moved so there we have them. Pretty though. The Christ candle will be lit on Christmas, but you can see on the side of the ring there, it says love. Today we light the candle of love. There's other Christmas things on the table. Just to create that sense that there's festivities and fun in the home as we prepare for the holiday. So I thought I'd bring you outside for just a minute. I'm not really dressed for this and there the light just came on. I'll give you a sense of the front of our home is beautifully decorated by the upstairs tenants by our next door neighbors the lights down the street everything is so pretty but man oh man it's cold out pretty though there so I'm in we just watched a couple of Christmas movies and I got a, just a little bit teary but they're always so much fun to watch aren't they And I think of all the Christmas carols that have been sung and will still be sung. And I wonder if you have a favorite, favorite Christmas song, a Christmas carol or hymn, anything that reminds you of the season, merry and bright. In the bleak midwinter, frosty wind made mourn. Earth stood and silent. I don't remember the words, isn't that strange? We're coming up to the solstice, which is wonderful in my mind. It's our anniversary in a couple of days, and every day following the solstice, the days get longer. I know we'll just be heading into winter, but there's that hope of spring, and I cling to that. Although I don't wish winter away, that... That kind of negates the gift of the months that we have. But I have to find ways to really enjoy those months, don't I? We all do. We all live in certain areas of the world that have things that we don't like. And I am not a fan of snow. Or the cold, I would rather be outside at the beach. But on the other hand, I do enjoy... How the seasons change. The ebb and flow to life. The soft changes that happen over the course of a few weeks. Not the sudden change you get with a storm, but that gentleness. I look for that sometimes. Lots of changes right now. Changes in the way we're going to be worshiping in the next few weeks. Changes in family plans. All of it. Something that is just part of life right now. The pandemic has gone on longer than any of us imagined. And I think 
from those I've spoken to were all feeling fatigued by it. Like it's gone on long enough. Enough is enough. And yet we are challenged that we have to hold on a little longer. We have to keep ourselves safe and we have to keep our families and our communities safe. So we do what we have to do. We light our candles. We enjoy our meals. We enjoy the beauty of the Christmas lights. And the Christmas movies that bring a tear every time. It's all part of the season. And this week I'm going to settle into that season. I have a few days with not as much to do and a few days with lots to do. So I'll pace myself. And I hope you do too. So this 21st day of 90 in my video challenge, I hope that it finds you well. And if it's at the beginning of your day, enjoy it. If it's at the end of your day, your day, I hope you find rest. And through all of that, know that there are people around you that care. And I care. If you have any questions, please do ask me. You can send me an email at doll, D-O-L-L-C-A-N, at gmail.com. And I will reply. You can leave a message in the video. If you are enjoying my videos, please do give it a like or a thumbs up. And subscribe if you want to hear more. Things are going to shift as we get into the 12 days of Christmas. And then into the further into the New Year's. So I'll be sharing lots of different ideas and techniques with you as we look at urban setting and also how we learn to live with family members who have congestive heart failure and what that means as far as living and the changes and the joy that you can still find in life. So that's on my horizon and I hope there's good things on yours. So take care. God bless. Bye-bye.